audience, understand, man. I don't think y'all know, man. We have a gaming page, bro. I'm gonna keep on saying it. We have a gaming page, bro. And even though I'm not up and uploading every single day on a gaming page, trust me, trust me, you're gonna wanna be a part of that because there's gonna be a point that I'm probably gonna start doing that, bro. So look, bro, I just want y'all, I mean, I mean, you know what I'm saying? I know that y'all want me to play the South Park, so understand the South Park will not be on this channel anymore because a lot of people have came to me and said, look, yo, the algorithm can mess up, you know, what you got going on on the Quizzy On Demand, and we don't want it recommending y'all gaming videos. We want it recommending the videos that we normally have on here. It's a dedicated gaming page. It's called Gaming With What? Quizzy, me your boy. You know what I'm saying? You gaming with your boy. So look, bro, it's gonna be down in the uh, comments. It's gonna be the first comment. It's gonna be pinned to the top. That is the page, so you can click on it. Y'all, we're gonna go ahead and get into Family Guy today. Peter meets Putin, all right? Man, do your boy a favor, man. Hit the like button, go down below. Subscribe to your boy, man. Okay, everybody, time to go to Grandma and Grandpa's house. They're dead. Not your Damn. grandparents, Peter. I'm talking about my parents. <laughs> Besides, today's Dolph Lundgren's birthday, and me and the guys always celebrate it by watching Rocky IV. Always find a way to embarrass us at my parents. That's the Polana all fruit. Pass the Polana all fruit. Would you please pass the jelly? <laughs> <laughs> we can. Come on, bro. She cannot be that. She cannot care that much, bro. Turned that many of you Family Guy fans under forty didn't get that reference. All right, you ready to watch hmm. Rocky IV? Let's do it. Yeah. Happy Dolph Lundgren Day. What the hell? Try blowing on it. <laughs> uh -uh. Well, we gotta watch the movie. Let me find out the secret to all uh, those cartridges being played or our spit, human spit. Because nah, this is for people that was born 80s, 90s. Y'all remember when we had to take the games out uh, of Nintendo 64 or something like that, you gotta take the cartridge or the Game Boy and stuff. <laughs> Blow it on your shit like a like a like a ghetto binge just trying to dry our nails. <laughs> And shit, you straight gotta do all that, you know what I'm saying? And I don't think that anybody, if you if you knew, if you, like, year 2000, you probably won't get that reference. Hello? 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 Yes, yes, this is Quizzy. Um, I'm doing the video, I'm gonna give the phone back to AJ. Here you go. It's our tradition. We could just stream it on your Apple TV. Turn it on, I'm sure we can find Rocky IV on there. I don't know how to turn it on. It doesn't have any buttons. Rocky Four. Let's just go to the damn store. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me try screaming at the PlayStation. Hey guys, why the long faces? Yeah, we were trying to watch Rocky Four on our DVD. Didn't work. Real slow. Long face ass boy. The Slender Man looking ass boy. The the Siren. You know that uh game, that video and shit, that tall siren and shit. That's a horror game and shit. That nigga looking ass boy. <laughs> Boy, <laughs> well, I know you were born in the 60s, stupid ass boy. Motherfucker got a, a ass on the side of his face, a, a, a woman's figure, a booty on the side of his face, boy. Strong jaw ass boy. This nigga look like uh, uh, Mumbo Jumbo. Uh, <laughs> this nigga look like uh, Mumbo from, from uh, the Banjo Kazooie game if he was alive, stupid ass. We got a bin of old movies. Rocky IV might be in there. Ladybugs, classic Rodney. A million ways to die in the West? No, thank you. <laughs> ah, nuts. This one's written in terrorism. That's, uh, Cyrillic. It's a Russian bootleg. Oh, no. All right, here comes the fight. Get ready to eat it, Drago. Yeah, Rocky gets up. Not only does he not get up, he's holding a sign that says, Workers of the World Unite. I'm what? writing Vladim. So, uh, so... So Russia must have changed the whole movie and shit where Rocky actually, where Rocky gets defeated. That's fucked up. Me and Putin, an angry email. Dear Vladimir. Ho oh, ho, that's telling him. I hope this <laughs> email finds you well. Other than that, all is well on this end. Chris continues to hit the books as best he can and Meg has become a woman in front of our very eyes. And send. Now, what? It sounded like that's your homeboy. Return to Captain America. Are you Trump? Okay, that was fucked up. I know. We don't really need to bring politics into it. I, it was just a joke. It was just, it was just, it was just a joke. To stop, it was just a joke. America, civil union. All right, Captain America, we have to get ready for the big fight with the other heroes. 
boy. Long nose, booty chin, nasty head ass boy. Receding hairline ass boy. That shit look like a fucking beach boy. Ugly ass boy. A beach, <laughs> a beach with a minimum amount of sand. Stupid ass boy. Strong face ass. Your face is stronger than your bodyguard's face, boy. Get the boy. Get the fuck out of here, boy. Get your slipper shoe hat, nose having ass been to get on your shit, boy. Look like you've been up for three weeks watching Russian porn. Nasty ass boy. You know I can say that, boy. Look like damn. Your chin need a diaper, boy. Damn, boy. I'm finna get on your shit, boy. Pussy lip ass, boy. I'm finna get on your shit, boy. Damn, your face strong as fuck. Vladimir Putin? Da, where is bathroom? I George Brett myself on plane. Oh. Did you just call me chicken? Yes, chicken. Viklay, viklay, viklay. <laughs> Sound different in Russia. Outside, now. Hi, we're from Publishers Clearinghouse. I have a million dollar check for someone named Chicken. You're going down. <laughs> Kick his ass, Peter. I ain't gonna lie, shit. My name would have been Chicken that day too, boy. Fuck you talking about. Yeah, kick his ass. Punch his ass, Peter. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Putin beat your ass. You had enough? Oh, looks oh, like Putin's shit. phone is buzzing. Donald Trump. <laughs> Heard you in town. Up for grabbing some cat. <laughs> they made the joke. Not me, but it was hilarious. I'll tell you something, if he were here right now, I'd kick his ass. Just like hundreds of dead journalists, I'm not afraid of Vladimir Putin. You're not such a bad guy. Well, thank you. To show there are no hard feelings. Hell yeah! I'm up for the strip club. Great! Who's driving? I was kind of thinking of taking my shirt off and riding a horse there. Get <laughs> out! That's totally my thing! Feels good on my drunk chest. You know what? <laughs> you're a good guy, Peter. Well, you're my friend now. Funny how this worked out. Who would have thought, huh? I guess things not always what they seem. Hey, Anime Wong, no ticky, no shirty. I'm just getting around, Rice Bowl. Jeez, lighten up. It's like looking in a mirror. Yeah, it was fun. <laughs> I'm gonna miss you, Vladimir. So, come with me back to Russia. I need friend. Oh, okay, okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Wheels up, let's go. We can smell the tiny bottles of booze. We gotta go, we gotta- That nigga's not allowed over here right now, boy. That nigga is no way. That nigga is taking any plane ride in any U.S. territory at all. Go now! Oh. Oh. Welcome to Russia, Peter. Man, Russia has the hottest and ugliest women in the world. All tens and ones. Whoa. Damn. Oh, I'm a whoa. I know what'll cheer you up. We listen to Funny Morning Zoo on radio. Hello, buttocks. <laughs> ah, humor. Now time for government-approved prank phone call. What? What? Is your refrigerator running? Yes. You are very fortunate. So what do you do for fun around here? You got direct TV? We have Time Warner. You got HBO? We have stars. 420p. You got everything you say, I... Shit, everything is fucked up there. I mean, I know this is not a real accurate description of Russia. Shout out to everybody that from Russia that's watching this. Y'all are my boys. Still, you Russian, you are my boys. Everybody, bro. On this channel, man, we accept everybody, man. But this is hilarious, though, bro. You gotta... You gotta we do, we do jokes about our presidents all the time. It's y'all's turn. Say something little bit worse. Yeah, I did it to myself. Please pass the aspic. Aspic? What the fuck is that? I'll have the aspic. What is that? Is that I grease? I too will have the aspic. Is that, is that cold grease? Eh? Yeah, see? Now aren't you glad we did all that work earlier? Peter, come. Also, American football. What? No! It's true. Can a Roger Goodell? You're a Russian spy? I don't know, Peter. Patriot to suspend, eh? Da. Tom Brady. Suspend, damn. You leave that gorgeous piece of ass alone. It's time someone stood up to you and survived. Please and the gentlemen. <laughs> Tonight, we are here to see the fight to determine East-West Superior. Hey, bro, that is not a fight that you want to do, bro. Like, I mean... Imagine you fighting Vladimir Putin in Russia. It's like there is no way for you to win. You lose automatically. If you win, you lose. If you win, you are going to lose. They're going to beat you down. <laughs> Really remaking Rocky. Damn. <laughs> I can't believe it, but it sounds like the audience. Enough! Oh, what are you doing?
doing here? How did I'm you not even really get over here, there? Peter. You've been hit several times in the head and sustained severe brain trauma. To settle uh, our differences. Say you. Yes, say me. What? The next day, he poisoned me on the limo ride to the airport with radioactive tea. Half my body weight, all my hair, and I have lesions that'll never heal. What? That's our president's best friend. What? Ugh, it's the guys. What do those losers want? Losers? Those are your friends. Hey, right. Peter. Hey, what are you doing tonight? We're gonna watch Cleveland put a garbage can full of coins in a coin store. Sometimes it takes my button. Got a wedding next week. I just want to clean it up a bit. Oh, well, that's too bad. Yeah, maybe next time. That sounds horrible. Guys, I got plans. We're striking. I don't want them to embarrass me. I love all the positive feedback. You can't switch up on your friends, bro. Like... If you if you if they been your friends and then, and then you come into some money or you you know do get other friends you can't switch up on your friends bro you know what I'm saying I mean it's nothing wrong with you expanding your mind and horizon you know what I'm saying but don't switch up on your friends that ain't cool but maybe you guys send a pick anyway here's more picks. Hey, you ever try that? Wingsuiting? I mean, basically, yeah. One time I jumped off a top bunk with a towel around my neck like a cape. <laughs> Quagmire, Joe, and Cleveland. How do you two know each other? Did you meet at the Harry Potter store? Peter loves that place. It was one wand, and I was using a gift certificate. Are you seven or eight <laughs> things on my body and ask for medical diagnoses? This thing here that looks like uh. a second elbow? I don't know what it is. Feel Balls! It's like it's filled with liquid. Well, I could take a look at it. Look, this! This right here is exactly why I've been avoiding you. I knew you'd embarrass me in front of Striker. Who cares? He's just some dude. He's not just some dude. Look, Peter, if you're so embarrassed by us and you think we're losers, well, then we don't want to hang out with you either. Good. Who needs you, bums? I got Striker. Oh, yeah? Well, I hope you two are happy together, you jerk. I mean, bro, you always try to get his damn wife, bro. Uh, you and Brian are like the weirdest friends that Peter could have. I spilled hot chili on my nest. <laughs> you're a riot, Peter. Hey, you sure you're up for this? Oh, hell yeah. When I commit to something, I go all the way. Like when I had Kathleen Turner's voice. Who's gonna get my scum bully? <laughs> get away from my scum bully, Kathleen Turner. <laughs> what? Wow, that's... Hey, so would y'all do this? Now, there's several things in life that people do. Like bungee jumping, skydiving. Apparently, this is another one of them. Like... What is that? You know what I'm saying? Like, gliding through the air and shit. I mean, I don't know, my boy. Like, but, but what y'all do that? I mean, for me, it's enough. Right now, in my life right now, for me, it's enough. But, I don't know, man. Parasailing? Yeah, yeah. Parasailing sounds fun. Uh, I, uh, no, I'm not, I'm not jumping off a fucking rock and shit. No, no, I'm not gonna do that. I, I can't do that. I don't wanna do that. Sure. That's some view. Riding in the airplane is enough for me. I know, isn't it? You see that rock formation over there? We're gonna fly right through the center of it. It's called threading the needle. Or we could just go home and watch Sound of Music. I can see you're a little nervous, Peter, but I'm telling you, it is easier than you think. Just when I thought he couldn't get any cooler, he goes, Oh, shit! That's him. Poor guy. He looks like a bowl of tomato soup. Guy next to him died in a fire. He looks like a grilled cheese sandwich. Yo, hey guys, what are we drinking? Beer? Hey, Quagmire, how about one of your famous sexual stories? <laughs> Friendly jokes indicating closeness. We heard about Striker dying. Yeah, <laughs> craps. Yeah, give it up. It's actually sloppy. Oh, uh, for me it's both. But listen, you really hurt our feelings. You can't just treat us like garbage and then expect us to take you back like nothing happened. We're tired of you taking us for granted. Yeah, this isn't even the first time you ditched us for someone else. Remember when you blew us off to hang out with Jerry Seinfeld? Why did your wife steal that cookbook? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry about your friend Stryker. I know it's gotta be hard to watch a man explode like a bug on a windshield. No, it's not. She's an asshole, bruh. She is a straight asshole. Out of everything you could have said, that's what you say. Dad, I never think I'm cool. Your friends thought you were cool until you dumped them. Oh, wow. I guess you're right. I tweeted him like crap. You did? Did Gary Glitter, Jeffrey Jones, and Jared from Subway spend the night? Uh, where the hell are you going? Wallace told me to go jump off a cliff to prove my friendship to the guys. Are, are you 
Are you sure that's what she said? Anyway, I gotta go jump off a cliff. Peter, wait, hold on, this is crazy! Hey, Quagmire, Cleveland, and Joe. It's your buddy, Peter. And I'm about to thread the needle to prove to you guys how sorry I am. You can go ahead and delete the Kennedy Center honors from my DVR. I'm, I'm never gonna watch that. Okay, here goes nothing. Peter, stop! Don't jump! Brian told us you were gonna... Why are you wearing a douche suit? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Not all of us believe that, but we took a vote, and I agreed I'd respect the majority. Look, you really treated us badly. Toast for goats? And you guys are cool. Fist bump. Oh, ah! video for the day so if you appreciate the video do your boy a favor man hit that like button go down below subscribe to your boy man just wanted to let y'all know man i really appreciate y'all man everything y'all do you know what i'm saying it's just like bro we get to chill every single day you and my boys man i know some of y'all watching this at work some of y'all watching this at school. Some of y'all getting off of work, getting off of school and watching and chilling. And sometimes y'all got a day off, man. Look, I just want to say, man, big shout out to everybody in school. Big shout out to everybody working. Mean jobs in between jobs, bro. Shout out to all of y'all. All of y'all are my fam, bro. And anybody, <laughs> anybody underage watching my videos, uh, um, don't show your parents.